Well, I moved to Los Angeles in 1999 from New York, and I spent my first year renting a small apartment with a, um, a small garden, and I spent that first year looking for a house. Um, and I, I found my geodesic dome online, basically, on a website, on a realtor's website, but uh, I didn't necessarily intend to find anything even remotely like that. I was looking for a, a junky fixer-upper in the Silver Lake area, and um, basically after a year of looking, I couldn't find anything, and that house just kind of popped up, and um, I think it pretty much changed the direction of my work, you know. Well, the house, um, it doesn't have any bedrooms, it doesn't have any closets, it's just continuous free-flowing space over three floors with the dome on top in this um, subterra subterranean area on the lowest level. And it feels more institutional than it does really like a house. Um, it doesn't feel like, um, well, it doesn't feel like a typical home, that's for sure. And it uh, immediately, as soon as I moved in, I started having events there because it just, it begged to be used in that way, having uh, people gather and uh, performances presented in various spaces.